Well, we are in Spain. We started off in England, we drove through France stopping at various vineyards. We then drove through the beautiful country of Spain to our final destination, Raqueta de Mar, a town on the Costa del Sol on the Mediterranean Ocean. Well, after the last video, people were asking to see the inside of our apartment in Spain. We also had questions about how much it cost and things like that, and I thought, whenever I'm watching YouTube videos and the people say, oh, it's really cheap, I'm like, well, how cheap was it? So, from now on we're going to sort of say how much things are, not to sort of brag about how much we're spending, because we don't like to spend a lot, but just so people know. Yeah. <laughs> so we tend to, to say what the prices are in dollars. So if I get 100 euros out, it used to cost us $110. Right. So for the sake of, I'm not going to worry about 10%, so one dollar is one euro. So. Our apartment is a three bedroom, two bath penthouse. We're a block from the Mediterranean and we are renting in the off season, which is October through the end of May. And that rents for 600 euros per month. During the peak season, which is the summer, it rents for $800 a week. That was our house and now we are off to play golf. It's about 65 degrees Fahrenheit and it's a beautiful day. And it's the end of November. Yes. <laughs> so, winter in Raqueta de Mar. We joined the local golf club, Player Serena. Normally it's 60 bucks to play 18 holes each, but we joined the club for a year. It cost us $900 for the two of us. So every time we play, it's only $5 for nine holes or $10 for 18. We tend to play every other day. Sand, is that well, I should use the sand out the sand, really. It's always full. <laughs> <laughs> What did you have? Gumba. It's shrimp, shrimp wrapped in a, like a pasta. It's deep, be hot. deep fried, right? Mmm. <laughs> Every Thursday, we like to go to the outdoor market where the city shuts off about a mile long stretch and fills it with clothes, bedding, shoes, and our favorite fruits and veggies. We use our spare change for the week and get a big bag of fruit and veggies for around eight bucks. Oh, here we go. 
You do it. Just make sure they're good ones. Yes? <laughs> yeah. What else? <laughs> At the end of shopping, we always stop for churros and coffee. And chocolate. Anything we can't find in the outdoor market, we get from the Carrefour supermarket in downtown Raqueta de Mar. Bacon, one dollar, 25 cents. The problem we have is we don't know what the Spanish words are for breadcrumbs and flour. <laughs> <laughs> Sal is so. We can Google it though. <laughs> <laughs> we're just too late. When we're out shopping, we always look for the cheapest bottle of wine because they're really all good. Go for it. <laughs> One of our favorite things to do is bike riding. Luckily, Raqueta de Mar has eight miles of bike paths that follow the coast to the town of Agua Dulce. Depending on the time of day, we always stop for tapas or breakfast. Cheers. Raqueta de Mar also has a port, and sometimes we find fishing boats unloading their catch. Today we found the fishermen fixing their nets. There is also the restored fort of Castillo de Santa Ana, built in the 16th century to protect the inhabitants from pirates. thing about living on the beach is the beach. We like to go down there and play bocce. That's it. Till next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.